Hey Scorpios, and welcome back for a general love reading. This is for all of the beautiful, amazing Scorpios of the world. Let's tap into your energy and see what is taking place currently. It is a general, so it's not going to resonate for everybody. So only take the part that fits and disregard the rest, Scorpios. Thank you guys so much for your support. I appreciate each and every one of you, Scorpios. And let's see what is your current energy. Your current energy is commitment. <laughs> And your next card is Rekindle, followed by Yin Yang. And you got temptation in the reverse. It says commitment is an important factor to achieve a successful relationship. I can imagine so, because if you're in just some type of friendship, friend zone, if there's no commitment, then it's not going to be successful. And it says every relationship has mag magical moments that can be rekindled. So... You got your yin to your yang type of energy, like the yin yang symbol, twin flame. So this is a twin flame. All right. <laughs> so some type of for some of you guys, you may have someone that's wanting to rekindle a commitment with you. Uh, re means to do over. OK, so this is something that is already established. OK, whether it's good or bad or indifferent. This is someone here that's wanting to come back, okay? Or maybe you're wanting to rekindle something from your person. It could be you too. Either you want to rekindle with your twin flame or your twin flame wants to rekindle with you. But it must be true. Because there it is, the four of wands. But there go the three of swords energy. Ooh, Scorpio, this energy has been off. Eight of Pentacles, Queen of Wands. Is that you and the Queen of Wands energy, Scorpios? A lot of regret. Are you somebody regretting you? Are you regretting dealing with the fire sign? There it is. They go to rekindle. Back down memory lane. Back down memory lane again, Scorpio. Well, they say it's the retrograde still, honey. So don't worry. It's going to pan off soon. And you probably ain't going to have no exes. You, you got the exes that's feeling some type of way now. But are, is it is they going to keep the, is it going to stay like, is they going to keep that same energy after the retrograde? <laughs> So I would I would suggest take it slow. I wouldn't I wouldn't rush into anything with anyone from your past. Somebody waiting though, because they're three of wands. Or or it could represent you're in this queen of wands and you're turning your back on the past and you're looking out there to see what else is out there. For some of y'all, that's what you're doing. It's like you saying, you know what, that past on, didn't do nothing but bring me heartache and pain. I'm going to focus on my work and my career, and I'm going to bring the harmony back into my life and bring my own happiness. They go to Nine of Cups. So some of y'all, y'all resisting your feelings for somebody, and you're moving on. I feel like you're trying to see what else is out here, okay, from your past. But they go that nine of cups. Now this could be you and this knight of cups, and it could be them trying to move away from you, the feeling of you, and it could represent that they're thinking about you and wanting this back because you got rekindled. There is the hermit though. Virgo energy. <sighs> Underneath the bottom of the page of wands, the knight of swords, the high priestess, and the tower. Mm. So I feel like somebody's behind the scenes making a move and they're not telling you They go the chariot and the uh, tower. And with that knight of swords, somebody may surprise you. <laughs> I feel like somebody from your past is going to do a pop up thing or maybe you're going to do that to them. Now, this could be you and this knight of cups. Popping up on them. Surprise, a surprise here. But there is a three of swords here. So this could have been something that happened with a third party or just somebody just heartbroken. Who I'm tired of looking at that third party energy. I've been seeing a lot of that. Some of y'all may have not. You may have disconnected because there was a third party. Mm. 
let's see. So you have the four of wands, the queen of wands, the three of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. You have the three of swords, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. You have the eight of pentacles and the hermit, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. You have the six of cups, nine of cups, and the knight of cups. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. So if that's your energy, you're offering your love somewhere. Or you wanting someone to offer love to you because there is a commitment and a rekindle here, god dang it. And the proof is with the six of cups. So you could be saying you could, but, but this hermit card is representing that either you're isolating yourself or you could have someone blocked. You could be blocking someone from coming in, offering you an offer that's going to make you very, very happy. So some of y'all trying to convince y'all self that y'all don't care no more with this queen of wands. And some of y'all, you know, you ain't messed up no more. Ooh, Scorpios. So let's make it make sense. Why is the Three of Swords here for Scorpios? Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. What's up with this Three of Swords for Scorpios? Why is the Three of Swords here for Scorpios? Well, we know what that's about. The lover, see? Gemini, oof. Here we go again. Someone making up their mind, needing to choose. Here you go again. Somebody could be with a toxic marriage, a toxic situation. Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. So they're not choosing this person. Oh my goodness, Scorpios. For some of y'all, this is what seemed like it's happening. Whoever your person is that maybe you've been involved with, if they had another situation and you disconnected from them, whether you knew it or not, they must have had another situation and that situation is, then fell apart. It's almost like their situation may have made up this person's mind for them. So don't be surprised if you have folks trying to come back because they was with somebody else and this thing came apart. Now they want to come back to you. I ain't saying it, it ain't legit, but I'm just saying it seemed like this was happening. People are waking up. People are waking up and having these spiritual awakenings here. See, somebody been worried and stressed out about something else. About this other situation. Ooh, three of swords. Ten of pentacles in the reverse. Just saw the queen of pentacles and the ace of pentacles in the reverse. Like I said, somebody, somebody, see, somebody, um, somebody here. Other situation is coming down, Scorpios. For some of y'all, it's a Gemini. Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, child. It's a lot going on. Somebody have not released this, Ten of Wands. Whew. I feel like somebody had another situation going on. Maybe somebody found out about you. Why is this hermit card here? I'm curious. Virgo energy. Enlightenment, introspecting. Um, like I said, it could be your person here is isolating themselves. They could feel like they're in a dark, dark place. And it could also represent that y'all may have somebody blocked. But I feel like this person ain't talking about something. Like, I feel like this person feels like they need, somebody may be afraid to be alone. So if you was in a situation here where you was in a third party situation with somebody and, they, and you left them alone because you found out about it or you got tired of being with it, 
whatever other situation they had that has come apart. Now I feel like somebody is alone. So why is the hermit here? Virgo, why is this hermit card here for Scorpio? Or you got them blocked. Now, you know, you will block them if they didn't get you in the third uh, three of swords energy. Or maybe this is vice versa. Five of wands in the reverse. Oof. I feel like somebody is hiding out because they got a lot of regret that they dealing with. Oof. It could be y'all. Y'all may have blocked this person because y'all don't want to compete. And there could be a lot of regret. There is the magician card here. Pisces energy. Why is the hermit here? Some of y'all said that y'all didn't want to be a part of this person's life and it's three of swords energy. See? Five of swords. Now it could represent that this is what they're doing. They're dealing with a lot of regret because of all the games. See, it's like I said, if you're dealing with somebody here and they're hedging a the third party, you probably left them and now I feel like the other person had left them and now they sitting here looking at all of the pieces that this, this came apart with this five of wands in the reverse in the because you got a, you got all of the <laughs> look you got you got the five of wands in the reverse the five of cups in the reverse and the five of freaking swords in the upright all right so this is that means that there's a lot of changes taking place whether they want whether you want them to happen or not or whether they wanted them to happen or not they're happening and now they're sitting here dealing with all of the games that they play, see? And they go to Seven of Swords, see? Now they sitting here looking at everything that they did. Because now somebody may be alone. What's up with this Queen of Wands? Who is this Queen of Wands for Scorpios? Some of y'all don't care no more. And y'all going on with your life. And now that's why they feeling alone. All, these, all, these, all the mess that they did, all the games they played. Now they alone and hiding out. And it could be you blocking this person because you feel like you can't trust them. Queen of, Pen Queen of Wands. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. There go the freaking Three of Swords. And there go the Emperor. I feel like this is the third party. Because you got the three of swords again. They go to the ace of pentacles and the three of swords and the eight of pentacles. Somebody don't want to work on this with this person no more. Because you got the ten of pentacles. Somebody was out a lot of money. Oof. Who is this queen of, who is this queen of wands for Scorpio spirit? Mm. I feel like somebody ain't giving to this queen of wands no more. See, there it is. Three of cups. See? See, there it is. It's coming out. Somebody that made up their mind. They go to two of wands in the reverse. You got the two of wands in the upright up here about the lover and the three of swords. And see, somebody need to make up their mind, Scorpio. See, look, look. See? See? I told you. See? See? Two of wands in the reverse. And they're quick. See? See, because you make them happy. That queen of wands don't do it no more. See, but they done lost you, though. They done lost you. Now that they done finally lost that other connection. Now they alone. Looking at all of the crap that they created, because you can you best believe you was innocent. Because you come, all these cards by you is in the upright, see? And the three of cups is in the upright. So somebody, it was a third party. Dang. It was a third party, Scorpios, that you walked away from. You like, uh uh, I ain't gonna deal with this. Now, what's up with this Knight of Cups? Wow, Scorpio, see? Playing those games, and that's what happened. Now this person sitting in the dark at home crying. <laughs> Look, y'all, I'm just telling you what the spirit is showing me. Now they're sitting at home crying. See, Knight of Cups, the Sun card. Now they, now they got to do some soul searching here. They in the dark. They go to Hermit card again. I told you, see? 
See, told you. The Knight of Cups, the Sun card, the Hermit, the Three of Swords, and you got the Chariot in the reverse. So it's like this person can't move forward, they can't move backwards. Yeah, this person is in like they between a rock and a hard place, but it's their own fault though, Scorpio, it is. Look at all these swords. You got the five of wands, the seven of swords, the five of swords. They played a lot of games. They did that. Now they happen to see the light. They got a soul search now to, to get to, so that they can move on. Because this is they, they the cause all of this. They were already with a toxic situation here and they went and brought you in it. So didn't nobody win. You've moved on, but they're going to want to come back. One more card for this Knight of Cups. Healing. Aquarius could be Aquarius. Could be a Leo. Gemini. Virgo. See? Knight of Wands in the reverse. See there? Somebody had to lose everything before they could find themselves is what I feel like. But I feel like the other situation that they had, it didn't serve their highest good anyway. It was about money there. So for whoever this person you've been dealing with, they've been dealing with another issue. I feel like for a while because you got the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. And you also had a Three of Swords with the lover. So like I said... They could have been with that person, but cheated on them a lot. Or maybe they've been with that person, and that person cheated on them. You know, they cheated because you're in the picture. But yeah, they, they whole world came crashing down and they're sitting there looking at all of the pieces, trying to put them back together again. Now, why is the six of cups here? Thinking about you now, now that now, now they thinking about you a lot, but they didn't already cause heartache and pain though. It says every relation, it says rekindle every relationship has magical moments that can be rekindled. Now they probably looking at you trying to see if you're single. Oh no, they coming back to you single. There it is, see? Because they not giving to that queen of wands no more because that queen of wands was, uh, they was sp spending a lot of money there. They coming back single, Scorpio. Ain't that something? I'm telling you, it was a third party. There it is right there. Somebody is dropping that situation here. Somebody was at a crossroad here, but it's like the decision been made for them. They can't grow with that. They done put all that time in there and look at it. It was all about money. Let me show you this Queen of Wands again because the card just came out. So I know this is what it is for somebody. Queen of Wands, that's who they was with. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. I feel like somebody is, I feel like this is somebody could have been a pay for play type of energy. Okay. See? It's a third party. But end up happening is somebody's finally made up their mind with the two of wands in the reverse. About who? About Scorpio. See? That's why they coming back to you single. Coming back to re re what it says, rekindle a commitment. You remember those were your cards, commitment and rekindle. So for some of y'all, your person getting your person done with the third party. And that's what I'm going to title it. And I know it's old cliche, but that's what the cards are saying. 
Nine of Cups, Six of Cups for Scorpio. So somebody feels like you bring a lot of emotional happiness to them. Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles. Six of Cups, Nine of Pentacles for Scorpio. Why is this here, Spirit? What's going on? Ooh, the Emperor, see? Somebody trying to do the right thing or somebody's trying to uh, take control. See, and there it is now in the upright chair. See, somebody's trying to finally move away from this other situation that they had. See, because it wasn't no good for them. See, because all it was doing was costing them money. Could be a Capricorn. See, they didn't work good together because it was all about the money. But you, God dang it, you come with the love and that's priceless. Wow, Scorpio, see? Somebody is freeing themselves from a situation. They freeing themselves. That's just what it is. Wow, Scorpios. Well, that came out clear. So now you have the four of wands, eight of pentacles, three of wands, and the nine of cups. What's up with this three of wands? I feel like you I feel like either you turned your back on this situation here that the Queen of Wands ain't you because we got the Queen of Cups here. Either you turned your back on this situation and you're looking out there to see what else is out there or they have turned their back and now they're coming towards you because you got the Six of Cups with the uh, Nine of Pentacles and their freaking Empress. So I guarantee you they see you as their Empress. Three of Wands. What's up with this Three of Wands for Scorpio? It's almost like your person is taking over your reading, their energy. Because that, that uh, retrograde is strong. What's up with this Three of Wands for Scorpio? All of their deeds, everything they did wrong, deceitfulness, all of that is showing up. What's up with this Three of Wands for Scorpios? Uh, <laughs> oh snap I see the queen of swords I feel like y'all looking out there to see what else is out here I feel like y'all have detached from this person see ace of swords and they go to eight of cups see see that's what happens y'all done y'all done turned y'all back on this person y'all say y'all not giving them nothing else you said because it was a one-sided relationship and you're tired of one-sided relationships because it was a third party. So y'all done took all that back. See, y'all have turned your back on this person. You say, I'm not giving nothing else. Nope. You put me in competition. I got hurt. No, thank you. No, y'all ain't playing with this person. Don't they got their nerve? <laughs> Oh, Scorpio, your folks got their nerves. So what's up with the Eight of Pentacles? But that's them, your emperor. What's up with this Eight of Pentacles for Scorpio? Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? Some of y'all done turned y'all back and y'all discipline y'all self and y'all just going to focus on y'all career and building y'all self, y'all own stability because y'all don't want to give this person no more of y'all time and energy. Eight of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. Ooh, but you got an Ace of Pentacles coming, though, with the Eight of Pentacles. Someone focusing on you. Someone wanting to do more for you. Ooh, Scorpios. Because I feel like someone know that they were blocking your connection because they had another situation. See? But look how they coming in, though. See there? So they intentionally blocked you because they knew they had another situation going on. See, for some of y'all, y'all already know that this person had somebody. <laughs> but I feel like they took advantage of you still because they wasn't offering much. Because they had a, a, a toxic codependency on another situation. The fool card taking a leap of faith, moving on to starting completely over. And this person, I'm talking about this person don't want nothing else to do with that other person. See? King of Wands and the Two of Swords. They don't want to see, they, they, they don't want to have nothing else to do with this person. This person is accepting that old relationship as an L. 
They said that they didn't. The only thing that they know is that, that, is that they lost a lot of money dealing with that situation. And I feel like they had a long time to get it together. But they didn't. It's because it was toxic, karmic. So your person say, no, I didn't took stock and then nothing happened. We had plenty of time. So nope, you won't get my, somebody say, you can't get me back now. Ooh, they don't want to work on that no more. They go to eight of pentacles in reverse and you got the eight of pentacles in the upright up here with the ace of pentacles. Somebody said that they don't want to deal with that person no more, Scorpio. They coming in to you. Yeah, that's what's going on. So like I said, this is for y'all who know that you was in a third party. Your person and left a third party for you. Somebody's realized that they were wasting their time over there anyway. I don't think it was, it was costing them money. It was making them think and act wrong because they was mistreating you. Uh, Breadcrumbing you while they pay all this karmic bills and you know, they, they did everything like they should have did it because this was a lesson because they would have not reached this emperor energy had not it's almost like somebody say they got to take control over their life because they're not happy now what's up with this four wands for scorpio why is the four wands here you got aries capricorn cancer leo virgo aries four wands for scorpios Page of Wands. Could be somebody reaching out to you to communicate with you or somebody may have been immature or maybe somebody's gotten there. Somebody feels maybe you make them feel like a youth again. You make them uh, they're very, very uh, happy, optimistic, uh, energetic after they've come away from under, because I feel like somebody feel like they couldn't really love you and express in your relationship like they wanted to. Now, I'm not exempting them, but it's almost like they were they were limited because they knew that they had that other situation that they wasn't letting themselves go from. But the problem is that somebody here will. It's not a problem. Your spirit, your person is finally making up their mind to address this with the page of page of um, with judgment here. See, it's about you. I knew it. See, could be a Libra, Taurus here. See, because somebody can't deny that that they had some something special with you. Once again, it's all about time, and you met somebody here why why they were stubborn and on their own journey, and they drug you in it. That's just pretty much what happens. Some of you may have known this person had somebody and some of y'all didn't know and you found out about it and you disconnected and you turned your back on this connection. But now they focusing back on you. See? Because little do you know, Scorpio, this person fell in love. They fell in love. I feel like they ain't never did that before because I don't feel like it was love where they was at. Somebody finna surprise you, Scorpios. I feel like it's them because they go to tower. Could be another Scorpio. They're having tower moments, I told you. That judgment with the tower card, they'll never be the same because once they see what they have been not trying to see, they can't go back. And this is what's happening for them. Once they reach that emperor energy and they have the spiritual awakening, they can't go back. They're not the same person now. Now, what's up with this nine of cups? Emotional happiness, contentment. This is what somebody wants. See, they go to star card. You look, you got the both of the wishes. See, you know, you everything. Oh, wow, Scorpio, you're everything this person wants. This person coming in to make up to you. Somebody's going to apologize to you about that third party. They go, that queen of wands. She in the reverse now. That, that somebody was holding back from you because they was with that karmic. But they're not going to do that now because they've made up their mind to walk away from it. Because that karmic situation was stressing them out. Because they really wasn't happy in it. 
Nine of Cups, the star card. Somebody's trying to heal things between the two of you. Now that they done finally walked away from their karmic, that third party. Because the third party, I feel like some of y'all was the third party. You, you was the side person, but I feel like they already had invested in something else that was karmic. That it has been and expired, but they continue to do it. Probably for support, but that's all it was about. It was all about the, the money, the image. And they still wasn't happy. Could have been a pay to play type of energy because you got the page of Pentacles with the Queen of Wands. We know how the Queen of Wands get. Somebody found somebody here for, for that purpose here and they got stuck with it. But they're moving away from it. The High Priestess. Pisces energy. Look at all. You got the Star card. The high priest is listening to their intuition. See, because you already got the Knight of Cups. There they go again. So see, somebody wasn't tapped in spiritually before, so they wasn't listening to their intuition. They was listening to their carnal mind. But they see it now because you got the sun card right, Nick. Not only do this person see it, y'all, this person did a whole about change about you. See? They coming for you, Scorpios, because wherever, wherever else they were at, it didn't work. And I feel like somebody is, see, they're finally finna move away from it. See, seven of Pentacles and the queen. Somebody tried to make somebody a wife by doing things for them. But I feel like that's all they wanted was the money or the benefits of just being taken care of. They done missed out. It wasn't worth it. And now they landed to race, rest and they're moving forward and they're moving away because they're coming towards you. See, coming to you, a single person. See, six of cups, nine of pentacles and the emperor. So, yeah, the emperor is coming for its empress to start completely over with you. Yes, yeah, Scorpio, your soulmate, yeah, your soulmate done left the third party and they coming in for you. All right, Scorpio, this your reading. If it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe.